Sponsored by Salud Beer Shop, located at 3306 North Davidson Street in the Noted District of Charlotte. Check out their huge selection of craft beer in bottles, cans, and growlers, and see what's on tap in the tasting room. Salud Beer Shop. Drink real beer. Hi, I'm Glenn. This is Dave for the NC Beer Guys. We promote North Carolina craft beer online at ncbeerguys.com. We do these videos to provide you with some information about the vast variety of great quality craft beers available across the state, and maybe you can find something about a beer that you want to get your hands on, or maybe you didn't know the beer was available and or from the great brewery that provided it. We are very pleased today to be drinking the Hot Drop and Roll IPA out of the Noda Brewing Company in Charlotte. This beer has been around a while, not so long in cans, but for a while, and it's just a great award-winning beer, and I'll get into that in a minute. So Noda says they are a homegrown Charlotte brewery located in and named after the city's most bohemian and artistic neighborhood, Noda, uh, and Noda is located at 2229 North Davidson Street. Noda says their approach is to handcraft small batch beers with a dedication to quality and variety. Our size and attitude allow us to brew unique and artistic recipes as well as our renditions of classic varieties such as stouts, whipped beers, and winter warmers. We are actually the only brewery in town with deep roots in the home brewing scene. After winning numerous home brew competitions by popular demand, we took our beer to the general public, and they've done a great job in the last two or three years now, I guess. Mm -hmm. uh, from our tap room to our cake to our cans, we hope you taste and enjoy the commitment, detail, and love we put into every last drop of our Nota beers. So the hot drop and roll is a little bit of a fancy and mm. treasured beer for Nota and for lots of us. Uh, it was a 2014 World Cup gold medal winner for in the American style IPA category. And as you know, with the popularity and the trendiness of IPAs. This was a very competitive category in 2014 and Noda came out on top and that says something about the quality of this beer. And, and David's done a perfect pour in our IPA glass. So that's yes. very nice. Now don't ruin mine. All right, okay, I'll drink the good one. All right. <laughs> um, so what do they say about hop, drop, and roll? This is the commercial description right out of Noda. Uh, they, well, they first know it's a 2014 World Cup gold medal winner in the American style IPA category, hops in your face, they say. Crisp, mouth-watering American citrus hops dominate for the ideal IPA character. It's hopped before, during, and after the boil with late bull additions of citra and amarillo for a complex flavor profile. The rich golden color, which they nailed here, uh, comes from a blend of English and American-based malts accented with substantial amounts of Vienna and wheat malt. This is the beer that started off from Noda, and that's what they want you to know. Yep. This is a 7.2% ABV IPA, and it is state renowned and even nationally renowned. And yep. we're anxious to we, we we've had it actually, so we can't. Oh say, yeah. We can't say we have it. We want you to experience it. We want to tell you what we think about it, and it, we, we're going to like it. We already know that. Oh yeah. And look at the quality of the pour, but also yes. the head retention of this beer. Yep. The beautiful color. It. it Classic beer profile oh, yeah. and look. Nice hoppy yeah, aroma, but oh. not not as hoppy as you might have thought from that description. No, I mean, it's, it's loaded with hops. And, it's, and it is an IPA aroma coming at you, and yeah. you don't get anything but hops, yeah, you but, get not, nice. but not to the degree you might no. would hop before, during, and after the boil. Yeah, this has got, the, the wonderful citrusy aroma is amazing. Mmm. This is so good. And a certain amount of the sweetness and the malt comes through. Uh, I don't think the, the hop overpowers it. It's not, hop is not the only thing you can take from this beer. No, no, no. It's, it's, to me, it's not overly, I mean, you know, when you expect a super hopped up beer that you maybe get this lingering bitterness in the back of your throat after you have it, I don't get that with this. This is a really clean IPA. I mean, it's But now, not nice. being a hop fan, it's pretty hoppy to me. Oh. I think it's, it's, it's good. It's great for the style, obviously. This is uh, more professional judges than us think oh, it's yeah, great yeah, to the yeah. style. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, it's plenty hoppy for me personally. I, yeah, but I, I said I for something so hoppy, I'd expect that little bite in the back, mm -hmm. and I don't get mm -hmm. that. And I actually, that's what makes it much better than the other ones because this one doesn't have that. So you're getting all that hoppiness and not that lingering bitterness. 
Well, I think that's true. There's no bitterness. Oh, there's no freaking, There's no bad bitterness. There's that good hop bitterness, yes. but not the after taste. Freaking awesome. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Noda is fairly uh, widely distributing this product now in the cans. Yep. So many of the better uh, craft bottle shops and um, if you see it in some of the, yeah i mean hopefully sometimes you'll see them in other uh you'll see them in your favorite bar or that serve craft beer but they're not, the draft is not widely available no so if you're in charlotte you're probably only in you, charlotte, you, in charlotte find it on draft yeah you will find the cans a little more widely than just in charlotte mm -hmm. uh, and it, at and least to raleigh and uh some in the mountains but it's still kind of rare but it's well worth it getting your hands on. If yeah, you're hunt, looking, it, hunt it down. If you're looking at something that's uh, been well judged and where, if, if it matters to you what awards and medals and the big beer people think, they like this beer, so you should try and maybe judge your judgment against theirs and then you can kind of calibrate your own palate. Yeah. How about that? That works. Calibrate your own palate. That's right. We know this is award winning beer, so see what you think of it. That's right. Until next time, this has been the NC Beer Guys, and remember, drink local, and keep your beer dollars in North Carolina.